Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy, Dr. The Gamer, back again with another video. Now, I know I said like two videos ago, it was my last video focused around 120 FPS, but today's video, it's just too good to pass up. So 120 FPS uh, has been out in Fortnite Mobile for about a week so far. And one of my biggest takeaways from 120 FPS is that it makes your device feel like it's going to explode at any moment. So the iPad Pro, whenever I play on it with 120 FPS, it feels like if I cracked an egg on the back of it, let it sit for 10 minutes, I would come back to a completely cooked egg because of how hot the freaking back of the tablet is. Uh, so what I did is I went online and I researched to see if there's any phone or tablet coolers and to my surprise, there actually were. So today I have a supposedly phone and tablet cooler that maybe should be able to cool off my tablet a little bit while I'm playing Fortnite Mobile uh, so that I feel like it's not just going to absolutely combust into flames. As you can see, I haven't opened it because I want to give you guys my first reaction. I have a feeling it's not going to work at all. So that's why I sort of wanted to wait and do this. Uh, it's from a company called Too Fun. Uh, I found it on Amazon. It had Amazon Prime, which I was pretty surprised. Uh, this is not sponsored. Uh, so if this product works that's really cool if it doesn't work then too fun sucks i don't know so we're gonna go ahead open up the box you know a little unboxing channel today for you guys got what we got no way yo what it has a carrying did i buy a cooler this is a carrying case why is there a carrying case for a phone cooler there's a little instruction manual uh no surprise it's all in chinese so i have not i haven't been studying my chinese so i might be uh screwed today so uh, let's go ahead and open up the package. Um, so, okay, this up top in the inside of the package is the actual cooling radiator. So, on one side, you have the fan, which is what is supposed to blow onto uh, the cooler and sort of dissipate the heat and cool things off. On the other side, you have three suction cups, and then you have uh, what I believe is an adhesive pad. So, let me just see. Yeah, it is sticky. So I guess I'm just going to slap this on the back of the tablet. Hope that cools off. And then uh, we also have a braided freaking charging USB-C. What? Bro, I paid 25 bucks for this. I thought I was going to get scammed. These are some high quality materials then. A uh, little manual, which is good because I actually have no clue how this works. Okay, so the only instructions is to just like place it on the phone uh or tablet there's something else in here oh sick it has more uh, adhesive pads so if i mess up that was i was scared as well so if i mess up with this on the placement i can go back and do it again which is probably going to happen because i play fortnite mobile on a stand so i can really only place the core like up top here or on the sides the cpu uh is right under the logo which generates the most heat so that's probably where i should place it but since i play with this stand i'm unfortunately limited uh to where exactly i can put this bad boy all right so i'm feeling like pretty much like top center of the tablet because i feel like that's where i can place it if it doesn't work you know we can try multiple placements in this one video okay here we go boys let's just go and slap this bad boy on here i don't know i mean i think i think we should press it in kind of hard all right it seems seems pretty sucks so let me go ahead plug this into my uh computer all right there goes that plug this into the top of the cooler and then all right yeah that's the fan that is very quiet i feel like it's almost not even on but maybe maybe that's honestly like a part of it where it's just so quiet you can't even tell it's on so i'm on the game i have the cooler running uh, and throughout the video, throughout playing for today, I'm going to be checking the sides because the top is where the cooler is. So the sides, like I can pretty much tell if it's heating up. Um, and I feel a little bit of heat, but honestly, I'm going to have to play for a while just to really get a feel. Um, and also, uh, 120 FPS is very stable right now on low graphics on my settings like it hardly drops any frames so to really put this to the test i'm going to bump it up to medium graphics 120 fps if i go to high graphics as you can see it bumps it back down to 60 fps so medium 100 is the max that it can currently go i'm not even sure if the difference is between low and medium but hopefully we should be able to tell the difference and see if this cooler actually works on fortnite mobile oh get collapsed buddy but off the bat, I already tell the difference between uh, low and medium. So medium, I guess, just has shadows in the game, uh, which is pretty good. Like, I honestly kind of miss shadows a little bit. Like, it makes the game look kind of clean. Um, but other than that, like, I could probably research the differences or something like that. Bro, why are there so many kids right here? You know, maybe this thing will make my aim better just magically. I don't know. 
Well, there's one kill. All right. But I mean, hey, I would even drop the single frame. Okay, I say I'm gonna drop the single frame, and then it drops right there. But other than that, my frames have been really steady. Just for the first bit of the game, but I think where this is really going to come into play is going to be the later half uh, of the gameplay for today. And I'm dead. TTV, by the way. Let's go, boys. I actually got a kill. These zombies are sweaty. Maybe it was like, oh, bro, this dude got a good FPS. He's got the good graphics. We got to put in some cracked out lobbies. Wait, there's flowers in this game? Yo! Medium graphics are hitting different, bro. There's actually grass. I think on, like, Fortnite Mobile Low, it's just, like, flat. But now on medium, there's grass. And still, not dropping frames. As you can see, hitting some shots. Hitting the freaking edit as well, boys. But let's go, bro. This game actually be looking kind of clean, man. Might have to just keep this on. What the? Yo, that's definitely a bot. He had some inhumane reaction. He just 180 What the? Bro, he's got aimbot. He has to be a bot. Hey, guess what, buddy? I got aimbot too. Uh-oh, look at my FPS. It's kind of quaking. Let me feel my tablet. Okay, tablet's not that hot. Frames are back to normal. And to be honest, like dipping 10 FPS basically means nothing right now. Ooh, now we got some real players in the game. Oh, my frames. They're dropping. What's going on? Oh, God, I just smacked that guy. That was sick. But my frames, that was not sick. I, I think I saw like 90 FPS right there, which is not what we want to see using the cooler. Bro, I'm just lasering kids. I'm just destroying kids. My frames are also getting destroyed. Oh my gosh. I'm not too, too worried. So after this game, I'm going to go just play on low graphics. Because right now, it's been about 20 minutes being on the tablet. And it feels definitely cooler than normal. Um, but I want to go back to low graphics and just keep on testing things, really. Holy crap. If that guy had, like, half good aim... I'd probably be dead right now, but hey, he doesn't. Let's go. Oh, oh my shred, bro. I just got melted on. Bro, is he shooting fireworks at me? Yo, this isn't the 4th of July, buddy. As in the 4th of July, buddy. Get out of here. Let's go. So, I mean, frames right now, just walking around doing nothing. 120, they seem fine. But the fact that they dipped as much as they did in the game scares me a little bit. All right, boys, we're going to go back to low. Maybe that'll help out the heat a little bit. Like, to be fair, though, I think it feels a little cooler. Like, I also might be getting, like, placebo right now. Like, I might just be thinking that. But I also don't know what I was expecting from, like, a 2-inch fan. Oh, oh, I actually, I killed him. I did not expect that. Bro, where is he? Oh my gosh. Kid who's playing hide and where? Where was he? I swear my guy was playing hide and seek with me. I did not know where he was. Alright, about 35 minutes in, and I think that it's actually working. Like I would need like a temperature gun or some sort of way to actually tell like the, the temperature, the heat of my device. But just from feeling it, like it feels cooler. It's still hot, it's still warm. It's not like burning though. And that was a thing. Like it was literally scary. Like, after playing on this for, like, 30, 40 minutes, you feel like it can actually, like, hurt you 
if you hold on to it for too long. But then again, I'm not a scientist, and this isn't like an actual science experiment, so I might be completely wrong. Bro, I just pulled out the craziest retake on that kid. <laughs> Bro, why does that work so well with me? Just spraying back at people's faces. It just works. I don't know why. Oh, shoot. Maybe this freaking thing even gives you better luck. Let's go. Oh, my guy wants the llama as well. No! What the heck? Why is this fight going on so long, dude? Why is this kid so sweaty, man? I'm on mobile. Chill out. Holy crap, I just got beasted. Dude, now there's someone else? Holy crap. I might be dead here. Yep! Nope, dude! I can't re-edit that because I'm on mobile. Oh, uh, why is that a World Cup qualifier lobby, bro? Alright, guys. So, it's been about 45 minutes. Uh, I'm not going to play any more Fortnite because I feel like I've already played a lot of Fortnite. But at this point, I don't see the device getting much harder. So, it seems a little cooler. I'm not going to lie. Like, the more I play with it, like, if I keep playing with it, probably for like another hour or two. It might, like, this this cooler might stop working. But then again, it is one tiny cooler right here where the CPU is there. So what I kind of want to do is to order two more, put one right here, one right here on this side, and one on the other side. And then I feel like we might be getting somewhere. Because at the end of the day, this is an 11-inch uh, iPad. It's iPad Pro, meaning it's supposed to be fast. It's supposed to be able to handle this kind of things. And it does, but I think overall... It's a little bit cooler to be fair but yeah that's been the video i know it's really interesting but man i'm probably gonna do another one of these very soon in like a week or two uh when i get two more of these bad boys and make like a really good video on it but guys i appreciate you stopping by and watching today's video as always if you enjoyed it make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel if you guys knew but on that it's been a boy Doc the gamer and i will see you guys in the next video peace